This is your weekend news roundup, a summary of the major news stories of the week in 101 seconds. I am Kim Lee Levy. The opposition People's National Party says it will be going to court to seek a declaration on the legality of the government's use of back-to-back -back states of public emergency. Opposition leader Mark Golding says the party has sought and now received legal advice on the two most recent SOEs that were declared on December 6 and December 28. As the National Housing Trust, NHT, prepares to begin accepting applications for a refund of contributions made in 2015, it is urging persons to be on the alert for scams. Eligible contributors are being reminded that applications for 2015 contributions refund are being accepted as of January 2023 and that these must be made online. Pele, the Brazilian football legend who won a record three World Cups, died on Thursday after a long battle with cancer. He was 82. The stadium where the great Pele played some of the best games of his career will host his funeral on Monday and Tuesday. His casket is to be carried through the streets of Santos, where his storied career began before burial. That was your weekend news roundup. A summary of the major news stories of the week in 101 seconds. I am Kim Lee Levy. Keep safe and have a great weekend. Love 101's Weekend Roundup is brought to you by Jamaica Customs Agency, country above self.